One of the best ways to optimize the performance of your home theater is with Dirac. And we're, today we're gonna to be talking about Dirac Active Room Treatment. And joining me is Ricard, Vice President of Sales for Dirac. So Ricard, what is Dirac Active Room Treatment and what's the problem you're trying to solve? So whenever you play sound in, in a room, you are going to create uh, resonances that stay on in that room. So basically lingering noise that's affecting the, the, the audience that's being played the moment right after it. So what Active Room Treatment does is that, that it, it takes away that lingering noise that sits around in the room after it's being played, leaving room for the new sound that you want to listen to that's being played continuously. And that's, that's a core of what ART does in, in the fashion where you have active speakers playing not only the audio you want to listen to, but also supportive audio that, that uh, takes care of supporting each other in order to accomplish this reduced decay time. Okay, so you hear, so basically the goal is for you to hear the sound, not the room. Right. That's okay. a good way to put it. Okay. So can you talk a little bit about Dirac and, and what we have currently have available on our AVRs? Sure, Phil. Uh, so Dirac is providing a software that does audio enhancements. So we provide Dirac Live, which is a software that uh, comes in different shapes and forms. So you have three levels of features, of licenses that, that's applied. So currently on the Dan and the Marantz devices, we have room correction mm -hmm. and bass control. Okay, so I remember actually, wow, three years ago, we first talked about the implementation of Durac Live, on right. and on our on our newer models back mm -hmm. about in twenty now twenty 2020, twenty 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 three twenty twenty three yes, yeah. and then we talked about at that time that we were going to continue to add more functionality, mm -hmm. and then last year we added bass control. So, and can you talk a little bit about the difference between direct live and bass control? Right. So, room correction, which is basically the, fun, the, the, the core feature of direct live, which you need in order to run the software, deals with alignment. So, alignment in frequency and in time and basically phase alignment. So, making sure that all of the speakers are not sending out sound at the same time, but sending that at different times. So, it arrives at your ears at the same time. It's one wave front hitting you at one point in time. And then looking at bass control, which we last year merged single subwoofer and multi subwoofer into one joint uh, license model uh, and taking down the price point on it, um, that deals with uh, seat to seat consistency. So making sure that any room modes that exist in a room are minimized, regardless of where you put your subwoofers. So those, those two features have been rolled uh, out already to Denim Rance users and, and is doing well. Yeah, and we've noticed that one of the most um, the challenges, the one of the biggest challenges in most home theater spaces is even accurate bass response. So th there's been a, that, so bass control has been widely regarded and, um, and, and everybody loves it. But they've been asking for another um, technology because if you think about a room, the things you have to worry about, of course, is timing and to make sure everything mm -hmm. arrives at the right time. The next thing is trying to combat the issues with bass because of the because of the the um, how the bay how subwoofers interact in the room, mm -hmm. and then the next thing is all the reflections that happen in the room. Yeah, first reflections and stuff like that can also smear the sound. Mm -hmm. So you have another. Um, uh, technology that we are going to be introducing later this year on Din and Amaranth's AVRs, and that is? That is Active Room Treatment, or ART, uh, ART, uh, as, as we abbreviate it many times. So ART uh, is what we have cooking that will be coming to Den and Amaranth's users, and what that does is that while, while Direct Live and Room Correction deals with making sure that every speaker is optimized and playing in a time-aligned fashion and, and alignment for each speaker per se, what uh, ART does is it makes sure that the, the speakers start cooperating and helping each other out in uh, obtaining that optimal sound field. So the idea behind ART originally was how can we, instead of making sure that we get the most out of every speaker and making sure that they are, um, are calibrated so that they can coexist in the same listening space, mm -hmm. 
the idea was born, what if we make use of the entire system in order to let each of the speakers not only play the audio that's intended for that speaker, but also support the other speakers in making sure that they can perform at their best, uh, best case scenario. Okay, so if you think about it, um, the three different tiers of Dirac. The first part is you have to put the speakers where you have to put the speakers, right? right? right. And sometimes that may not be the optimum mm -hmm. position. So Direct Live, Direct Live helps compensate for that. That's you know, right. so if your room speakers are not perfectly equidistant and all of that stuff, it makes it better. Mm -hmm. The next thing is how bass happens in a room, how your subwoofers interact in a room. Even if you put your subwoofers in the best place possible, you're still going to have peaks and nulls. Mm -hmm. And that's where bass control comes in. Yeah. And then the last one is the reflections of the room mm -hmm. that, that impact the sound. And that's where active room treatment. So you basically... Ma uh, making it easier to, for the user to basically fit the system into their room and it to be optimized without having to put in a bunch of fancy room treatments and things like mm -hmm. that. That's a good way of putting it. And that's part of where the, the, uh, the name we chose for the product comes from. Mm -hmm. So as opposed to passive or traditional room treatment, this mm -hmm. is active room treatment in the sense that the, the speakers are working in a system to actively uh, take out lingering noise. Mm -hmm. So how that demonstrates is that the decay time is significantly reduced. Mm -hmm. So uh, noise that will linger about in the room after being played is taken out more quickly using ART. Yeah, and if you think about it, most this room that we're in right now is a is a is a professionally built theater. So it has bass traps and diffusion and absorption panels, right. but my wife is not gonna let me have all of that stuff in our house. Right. And so now you're trying to say, how do I get a better experience without physically having to put those mm -hmm. in the room because the appearance of the room matters almost as much as the performance in many applications. Right. And even if you could use room treatments, you still want to use this, but even if you don't, this really helps out a lot. It does, it does. And it's a, it's a new type of technology that's unseen before where we've tried out this extensively over time. And first time we rolled this out was in the automotive industry where we are, we're having much more challenging environments given the constraint of that space. Uh, now being able to bring this to the home arena is, uh, is bringing that into whole different new types of settings and also being able to compensate for each of the unique settings which you have in your home environments where every, every listening space is unique, basically. Mm -hmm. So to tell you a little bit further about what, what's behind ART and how that's working, um, so while um, ART is operating from 20 hertz up to 150 hertz, you will be able to play this not only on the subwoofers you have, mm -hmm. but also on speakers which are able to uh, operate within that frequency range. Mm -hmm. And that means that you, you don't only have the support of the subwoofers in order to accomplish this reduced AK, mm -hmm. decay time, mm -hmm. uh, but also the other speakers to help out in mm -hmm. the listening space mm -hmm. to, to accomplish this. Yeah, and, and I, will, I had an opportunity to hear this a couple of years, I think maybe two years ago, right, yeah. um, when it was kind of a, as a concept. It was a laptop and a bunch of yeah, and a bunch of lights right. running just for us to actually hear it. And the, the difference was dramatic. Mm -hmm. So I am I am incredibly excited for this pro for this to launch. Now this is we're announcing it now, but this is probably going to um, occur later in um, the towards the end of 2025. Mm -hmm. But we just want to talk about what it is because of of the announcement. Right. Okay. So so let's talk a little bit about licensing. Mm -hmm. Okay. So there's you talked about so so how would you get the licenses? So 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 can you talk about that? Right. So just in the same way that the user gets room correction or bass control licenses today, they go to direct.com, mm -hmm. add that to the basket, then check out. We will offer ART in the same fashion. So mm -hmm. They would navigate to direct.com, uh, either to uh, the Denna landing page or the uh, Morant's landing page, or directly to the device they have and find the ART uh, license there. Go ahead and add that to the basket, either as a unique license to add on top of what they already have with room correction or, or base control, or as uh, a bundle deal, getting the whole package at, at, at one point. And then check that out, uh, in, uh, check out the basket and, and obtain the license and then add that license to their account, and that will be associated with uh, their unit. Mm -hmm. And when that's done and ready, you will see that popping up in Drag Live when doing the next calibration. Okay, the software. Yes. yes. Okay. Yes. Yeah, so you can start off with uh, 
Um, we're going to do videos, by the way, to go through the whole process of either adding active room treatment to your system if you already have a, a direct live base mm -hmm. control license yep. or from scratch starting from the very beginning. Right. So as we get closer to the launch and towards the end of the year, mm -hmm. we will make sure that all that information is available and all those tutorials are available. So if you decide you want to do this, you will have the opportunity. Mm -hmm. and, and as we mentioned, um, if for, to get active room treatment, you also need to already have Dirac Live full. Right, that's correct. So okay. to use Dirac Live, you need a core license, which we sell as, as room correction, the room correction license, which, which in essence is getting the room correction algorithm to mm -hmm. be able to use that, mm -hmm. but also the, the software itself mm -hmm. that which, which applies that. And then for uh, the users who want to enjoy active room treatment on their subwoofers, mm -hmm. they will need room correction and base control in order mm -hmm. to do that. Exactly. So if you want the full power that 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 direct can, direct can use you need the you want to get the full the full kit. right so uh, since uh since active room treatment is operating from 20 hertz up to 150 hertz subwoofers will help out a lot in accomplishing what art does okay okay so to find out more about um direct and direct active room treatment mm -hmm. where should they go so we have articles uh, on going on a deep level, uh, speaking of MIMO technology uh, on, on our website, mm -hmm. where they can download white papers and, and read more into details of it. There's also summaries on, on, a, high, uh, on a higher level, that's it's on the website, describing how air active room treatment works in, in the way that it uh, accomplishes this reduced de decay time. Okay, and of course, check out our, the, um, our YouTube channel where we'll actually have more information on this great new technology, as well as tutorials in the future. So, Ricard, thank you very much for your time. Thanks for having me. And you. I'm excited about uh, active room treatment, and I'm sure you are too. So take care, and we'll talk to you soon.